What's up, RHS? Hey, RHS. Hey, RHS. Hey, RHS. Hey, RHS. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, RHS. My name is Sam Bayon. And I'm Gabby Gebner. And today is Thursday, May 13th, 2021, and this is your Daily Dose. Let's start with some news from the Counseling Department. Students wishing to test out of a class should see their counselor for paperwork. There is a $35 refundable materials deposit for each class. Also, any students who think they need to make up a class or two, email or visit your counselor to inquire about summer school. Many of you are excited to see this year's yearbook. Yearbooks will be distributed next Wednesday, May 19th. Seniors, you will pick up your book in the LMC after your fourth hour final. Underclassmen, you will be coming down during your seventh hour to pick up your yearbook in the LMC. We are expecting to have about 10 to 15 yearbooks available for purchase on Thursday, May 20th, beginning at 745 in Ms. Haddad's room. They will be first come, first serve, cash only purchases. <laughs> they are gone. This is, there is no way to get a book. Seniors, Pizza King of Wyandotte has graciously donated a free pepperoni roll to all of the seniors at RHS. Seniors, in order to get your gift certificate for your pepperoni roll, please stop into the post at lunch or see Mrs. Kamiski during the school day. Thank you, Pizza King. Now some news from the tech department for seniors regarding Chromebook turn-in. Hey there RHS, Mr. Shemansky here with a special announcement for our seniors about their Chromebooks. So first off, I just want to say congratulations on nearing graduation here. You're almost done, you're almost finished. You should all be very proud of all the work you've put in this year, all the adversity you've overcome in this school year unlike any other. Now, with the end of the year almost being here though, it's time for you to turn in your Chromebook, your case, and your charger. If you go in the LMC, in the back right corner, just outside the technology department, we'll have a table set up with a space where you can put your Chromebook and then a space where you can put your charger. You can feel free to start dropping these off anytime once your finals are done and you're finished with your Chromebook. Wave students can come anytime during that period as well to drop off your device and your charger. Also, be aware that you're going to lose access to your school Google account. So this means anything in your school Google Drive is going to be deleted after you graduate. So make sure you go into your Google Drive and grab any of the files and documents that you think you might want so that you can keep those after your graduation. Feel free to swing by the technology department inside the LMC if you have any questions. Have a great day, Bears. Seniors, it's almost time to turn in your Chromebooks. Your Chromebook with case and charger can be placed on the table set up outside the technology department in the back right corner of the LMC. You can drop them off anytime after you are done with your finals. Make sure to get anything you need off your Google account as well because you will lose access to your school Google account once you graduate. If you have any questions, you can visit the technology department for more information. If you're in marching band, all uniforms and equipment should be dropped off in the band room ASAP. Now let's pause for one quick question. Good morning, RHS. Who's your favorite music artist and why? Uh, Kevin Gates, because my favorite song is Big Gangsta, and I'm a big gangsta. Who's your favorite music artist and why? I'd have to say Young Boy. Uh, he's a very inspirational, good guy, all around, just role model. Oh. Uh, my favorite artist is Polo G, just because I like his flow. Who's your favorite music artist and why? Uh, Lil Baby, because his, his songs just be banging. Probably Spongebob when he, rock, when he rapped about rip, ripping his pants, because it's pretty relatable. Uh, NBA Youngboy? Why? Because he's a bottom boy survivor. Who's your favorite music artist and why? Uh, probably Frank Ocean, just because his music's really chill. I like it. Uh, little TJ. Um, I probably have to say like Travis Scott because you know he's in Fortnite. <laughs> Khalid because he makes like feel good music, I guess. Fiji no way because he's just super inspirational. Attention seniors, you have two more days of school before your finals week. As your year is winding down, there is lots for you to know. Prom will be held May 21st on the football field. Tickets are currently being sold for $50. Get them during your lunch this week. Additionally, everyone attending must have a permission slip turned into the main office before the event. 
Pick up a permission slip at lunch in the senior lounge or from Mrs. Armaniac anytime. There will be a drive through celebration event for seniors on May 27th from 5 to 7 to pick up your awards and other special gifts. Any seniors planning on attending college in the fall, the counseling department needs to know what your plans are. Once you have made your decision, please email Mrs. Doyle in the counseling office so a final transcript can be sent to that school upon graduation. Now here's Derek with sports. Softball played Monday and scored 18-3 against Trenton. Better luck next time, girls. Softball played yesterday more than more on that tomorrow. The girls' soccer team played on Monday and scored 8-0 to zip and lost to Ezra Ford. That's all for sports. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Derek. Are you interested in an adventure to England, Scotland, and Ireland next summer? Explore these three, country, these three countries with Geo Addicts June 17th through the 26th, 2022, and visit important historic sites, discover the diversity and heritage of these cultures, and return home with a newfound global perspective. Scholarships and fundraising is available. Please see Mr. Souls or Ms. Merrifield for more information. PBIS Virtue this month is Legacy. Here's Cameron with Senior Legacy. The end of the year Virtue is Legacy. So seniors, what will your legacy be here at RHS? My grades and all of my achievements I have, I have received in botany. Probably for the sports I play and uh, being Gerald Nagy and Jalen Pitchford's therapist. Um, See, so just being a nice guy all around, you know, kind of funny, I guess. I think my legacy will be always being respectful to my teachers and having good grades. Grades, just doing the best I can. My legacy will be being the life of the party. The most good-looking kid in the whole school, most athletic kid in the whole school, and Jalen Pitchford's boyfriend. So when I leave high school, I hope that my legacy will be that I left some kindness behind and some goodness in the underclassmen and in the teachers. I really hope that I'm able to be remembered as someone who was helpful and nice and um, important to the school. So I hope everyone has a bunch of good luck after they graduate and thank you. Seniors, you definitely left your mark here at RHS. We will miss you. Now back to the anchors. Anyone looking for a job, Sports Bar Grill is looking to fill all positions. The general manager is also willing to create an internship opportunity for the right individual. Please email Bill Gavin at bill at sportsbar-grill.com for more information. Wyandotte Tees has just released their newest flavor of the month. This design is great for alumni, future grads, or any Wyandotte bear lovers. This is a unisex Reglan tee. It is pre-order only and must be ordered online by May 19th. Go to accenttees.com slash flavor of the month to order. The Spring RHS Drama Show, the Untitled Growing Up Project, is now available to watch for free. You can go to showtix4u.com slash event details slash 50937, or you can find the link on the Roosevelt Drama Facebook page. Today, PBIS would like to recognize the following students for earning bear books last week. Shay Morgan, Ethan Rock, Seth Ayers, and Brianna Berry. Thank you for stepping up to make responsible choices that help keep the classroom a positive and welcoming place to learn. Happy birthday to Dalton Nanskoff, Brendan Bayon, Amelia Dixon, Raymond Heisel, Anthony Minjuna. Hey Gabby, how do you get a squirrel to like you? I don't know how. You act like a nut. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great day, RHS. We, we leave you with this. What's up, RHS? Can you name three things in five seconds? Name three music artists in five seconds. Uh, two Bags, Money Moves Gab, and uh, Gangsta Tim. <laughs> name three Avengers in five seconds. Captain America, Hulk, and Iron Man. <laughs> name three reasons why you would be late. I'm feeding my dog, I'm finding clothes, or I'm doing my eyebrows. <laughs> in five seconds, name three names that start with the letter Z. Zachary... That's it. <laughs> in five seconds, name three basketball teams. Detroit Lions, Detroit Tigers, and Detroit Red Wings. <laughs> in five seconds, name three shoe brands. Flip Flops, Chunky Filos, and Skechers. <laughs> in five seconds, name your three celebrity crushes. J-Lo, Elizabeth Olsen, and Jennifer Lawrence. In five seconds, name three Great Lakes. Uh, Lake Michigan, Niles, Ontario. <laughs> In five seconds, name three social media platforms. Snapchat, Instagram, and TikTok. Wow, Arches, that was pretty impressive. Have a good day.